guys, welcome back to another video with Just Too Cool. I have a review for you. It's been a minute since I've had or I've done a review. I have been told by a friend that I should do this. And it is the review of, and I have no idea how to say this really, of the hairbrush straightener. My friend that told me that I should review it has two little ones as well. So she understands and gets the fact that us mommies need something very quick and fast in the mornings and she said hey review it you won't regret it so here i am reviewing it and i have been using it and so far i don't really regret it it comes in this little nifty cute little bag here it is hair and all <laughs> yeah so I will go ahead and plug it in because I am a dummy and didn't do that before the video. So it flashes when you plug it in, off, off. And it's as simple as turning it on. So I usually do 410 and this is how fast it heats up. And I'm sitting here holding it. It's almost there. I think it's backwards. But you get the hint, this is real time, real time heating up and I feel it starting to get a little warm here. It's almost there. But I, when I first turned this on, I'm like, I did whatever I was doing, like washing my face or whatever and turned it on and looked up and bam, it was done. I was like, what? So this is by far the fastest um, straightener or hair thing that I have ever used that is as fast as it is. Now, it is fully at 110 and I am sitting here holding it. I mean, I feel the heat coming off of it. I mean, I'm touching it. I've used this on my daughter, my oldest daughter. You know how typically you burn the ears? <laughs> yeah, because I got those a lot when I was younger. No, I mean, nothing. It's, it's down in there, in the bristles. I do, I'm gonna show you how easy it is. This is my hair just waking up in the mornings when I went to bed with it damp. So now I'm going to brush my hair and you're gonna see why I don't brush my hair because it gets ginormous. Okay, so I've brushed my hair, gotten all the tangles out. So now I'm going to use my favorite spray, a heat protecting spray. It's uh, Beyond the Zone, turn up the heat. It smells great. Uh, I got this, I think at Sally's Beauty. I don't know if you can, where else you can find it. I haven't really searched for it, but this has been always my go-to. It's more of a um, oil base, so it kind of, uh, in a way, tames my frizz because I do have a lot of frizz. Uh, I make sure I get it well, especially underneath. I do section my hair off because now that I have cut it, I do have the layers in there and it's just easier to do so. You don't have to section it off. It is that easy to use. Start off by using the brush, normal brush, just holding it. That way I know that it's pretty straight. Go through slow, and like I said, I mean, you may be able to see the steam coming out, but it is not, it, it's not hot. It's, it's not hot, it's hot to the touch, yes. Again, still not hot. I feel the steam and the heat coming from it, nothing. So I just kind of do that, I'll scoot back so I can see a little bit better, or you guys can see a little bit better. And just go through slowly. I'm hoping that I can do this in real time to show you guys how fast it is. I mean, for the video pur purposes, I may take a little bit longer just to make it look good. <laughs> Switching over. So my hair is still long, even after chopping it off. I'm gonna do the back, attempt to do the back. Okay. And just in case there are any places I may have missed that need a little bit of taming, I go ahead and do that, and then there, there's the straightener. I mean, I could just step back, couldn't I? There's the bottom layer. And 
for the top. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do a little side part. Okay, there's my lovely, naturally curly, wavy hair. And I will say my hair looks really greasy, oily right now, and it is not the spray. It is the fact that I am out of conditioner and didn't realize it when I got in the shower last night. And to make up for it, I used coconut, a little bit of coconut oil, and apparently that was a little too much. <laughs> yep, at about, what, nine, 10 o'clock, I did not feel like getting redressed after I got undressed and in the shower that I was out of conditioner. And of course my husband has like the two in one and I'm like, nah, not happening. I'm not using that stuff. I mean, if you guys want to see this on like really, really, really thick and extremely, um, <clears throat> wavy somewhat curly hair I can do my daughter's um, and show you if she'll let me I'm sure she will uh, for a video she loves the videos so I mean this is hopefully gonna be real time just I, I will try not to do any cuts or mini cuts I guess I should say it depends on how many times I mess up in a video I'm using the viewfinder, the screen, and my camera rather than the mirror, and I don't typically do that. So I'm trying to see if I've gotten all of my areas. So this is done. I know I don't know about a lot of you guys, but this one, I appraised this because when I go to sleep at night, I get the little wave when you go to sleep. And with this, all I do to make sure I don't have that wave is that, and the wave is gone. So I love this because of that and how fast it is. Now typically it takes a little bit longer, a little bit more sectioning with a, a normal straightener, which I still do use that. The only thing that I'm not 100% crazy about on this is my hair is naturally wavy curly so anytime it senses even the littlest bit of humidity in the air it just does its own thing it goes poof so that is the difference between the normal straightener the kind that you could clamp and go down and the brush uh, the brush for me does not keep out the frizz um, that is why i use this but even with this it typically does not prevent the poofiness and frizziness uh, but I mean I didn't do anything special no type of like curling or anything I just wanted it straight just show, show the, yeah. <laughs> just so that I can show you guys how to speak uh, no that <laughs> um, it is great at straightening and very fast. Um, I guess I should talk about the price, right? So I'm not gonna lie. She asked me to, my friend asked me to review this. Um, I looked it up and it was about 200 bucks. It was like, I think 170. And I'm like, mm, no, I'm sorry, I can't do that. <laughs> not right now, maybe at another point. Um, so I guess a month, maybe two months went by and she sent me the link to show that it was on sale. It was on sale for about 60 bucks. I'm like, all right, all right, I can do that. I can spend about 60 bucks on a straightener. She, she loves it. I think it's gonna be a good purchase. So I did it, I purchased it. It came really, really fast. The company seems to be great. They have all kinds of other hair products. I did not check any of those out. Kind of kicking myself now because I bet they have really good, uh, like, heat protectant spray and a lot of like volume because I need some volume right now. You see how flat this is? I don't know if the cell is going on currently. I know that it was a pretty long cell. Uh, it was like the $9 hair um, 
spray the heat protective sprays that is not one of them and they had their actual curling wands and their flat irons and all that on sale as well so check them out it's i'll post the link down below in the description that's my review my video of the brush straightener by this company that i don't know how to say and i really don't want to mess it up for me it gets four thumbs up if i had four thumbs right now i only have two like I'm going to get two more later. Uh, so you get two thumbs up. <laughs> if you guys want me to do, do more reviews, let me know in the comments below. Um, I will take into consideration. I would like to know what you guys would like to see. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. And now you realize that you didn't have your light on the entire time. That's frustrating. Look how good it could have looked. But no, you had to go without makeup and all of that stuff because you thought you were going to have the light. Hmm.